Electronica Veneta has developed a wind power generator trainer specifically designed for educational needs. The aim of the equipment, which includes real professional components available on the market, is to perform experiments on a standalone wind power generator under different weather conditions. Let us first have a look at how the energy flows when the wind turbine is working. The aero generator converts the wind kinetic energy into DC electricity. This process is managed by a charge controller. The electricity is stored into a buffer battery or converted to feed one or more AC loads. If no wind blows, the energy previously stored into the buffer battery feeds the loads. Let us now have a look at the main features of the equipment. This is how the workstation looks like. This is the indoor operation device. An electric motor directly coupled to the aero generator shaft simulates the effect of the wind on the generator. Here we have the buffer battery, we can just place it on the floor. The control panel features the operation diagram and includes all the instruments we need for the experiment. Here is the DC-AC inverter. Five lamps, the AC loads are fixed at the back side of the panel. The manual guides us step by step into a variety of exercises. Ok, let us switch on the system operating the switches. Let us also switch the inverter on, as well as some of the AC loads. No wind is powering the generator, so the buffer battery is currently feeding the loads. We can see here the wind generator output current, which is presently zero. If we use this selector, we can see the buffer battery current value, and if we switch again, we can see the inverter input current. The AC energy analyzer refers to the inverter output AC parameters. Let us now simulate the action of the wind operating the indoor device, and notice how the various parameters change accordingly. We may also connect an external AC load to the inverter outlet, such as this spotlight. Again, we check how this action affects different parameters in key points of the circuit. We can also use a personal computer running Windows for the data supervision. Just glancing at the screen, we can see in real time how the different parameters change. A very interesting tool allows the student to check the real-time trend of the power transfer at each branch of the DC electric circuit, for example, when one or more loads are on or off. Let us now draw the power output versus wind speed characteristic curve. We gradually increase the motor speed to simulate an increased speed of the wind and plot the curve accordingly. We save the acquired data, which can be recorded later. And finally, this is how the aero generator that includes a wind speed and direction sensor can be installed outdoor, alternatively to the indoor operation device. Thanks for watching this video. If you need more information or a quotation, please feel free to contact us.